recording. All right, there we go. Let's uh, get to the ship before we. Uh, how do we get out of here? Uh, get the hell out of here. We're not doing that. So, okay, so that's what t this episode is going to be. Okay, how do we leave? Oh, God, how do we leave? Oh, God, how do we leave? All right, so we're gonna do a sh we're gonna do a filler episode apparently. How do we leave? Okay, okay, we're gonna do a short episode because we. How do we leave? Thanks. I need help. I need help. How do I leave? Talk to the guy on the deck. Okay, talk to the guy on the deck. to the deck guy, okay. Hey, Decker! I just love the sound of the sea. So soothing, takes your mind off everything. It reminds me of my childhood. Oh. Okay. Welcome back, friends. Last guy here, and it's time for more FF8. Voice LP. I'm not n nervous around strangers anymore. Phew, I think I talk too much. I'm tired. Are you tired too? Yeah, I'm going back to the garden. This kid weirds me out. Why is that kid the leave NPC? Alright, so for today's episode, we're going to take a look at Selfie's Diary and at the Timber Maniacs, apparently. Where is Selfie's Diary? Why does, why does she have a diary in the classroom computer? Get a diary that everyone can read. That's odd. Alright, let's go. So today's episode will be filler, where we fill you in on things to read, apparently. Ignoring all the pretty ladies and going to the, to the thing. Ignoring Irving. Oh, let's talk Irving. Hmm, <clears throat> tough choice. Now do I go for the girl with the pigtail or the one with the bob? Or how about that brunette? This garden sure has a lot of cuties. I ain't talking about the oranges. Though I might be. Actually, I am talking about the oranges. Yeah. Uh, how do I get to the computer? Uh, why can't I not access the computer? Oh, this one, this one. There we go! Yeah, selfie's right there. Turn on the power and... Uh... Beth Garden, Message from Garden, School Festival Committee. School Festival Committee. I hit the wrong button one more time. One more time. Festival. There we go. Oh, Garden Square is where I'm supposed to go. Uh, uh, no, we're oh, here we go. The Garden Festival Committee. I guess it wasn't meant to be this time, but there'll be a garden festival next year, and the year after that, and so on. So we're still looking for new members. It's not like I've given up on this one yet. Hi, friends. I made a friend. I think I'll have my friends write stuff directly in here. I thought I'd have my leader, Squall, go first, but then I realized he'd never do that. So here's the order. Oh my god. Look, latest entry. Look at previous entries. How y'all doing? This is Irvin Kinez. Selfie asked me if I could write something. How could I refuse? Well, I'm here from Gabadia Garden due to personal reasons. I think I fit in quite well. What do y'all think? With so many cuties here, I look forward to getting up in the mornings. You seem like a good guy, but I don't know. Yo, Sup! It's... it's ill dinked! The hell do I write? Yeah, I knew. I said I'd write something, but I have nothing to write. Oh, wait. I, I love hot dogs. You know, the ones that are uh, always sold out. Anyway, that's it for me. Hello, this is Cutest Treppy. I've been quite busy with my seed duties, 
How's everyone doing with their duties and studies and training? For all those working towards becoming a seed, and everyone else, just remember, have fun. Why do I always end up sounding like an instructor? Perhaps I'm a little too... serious? Not at all, cutest. We really look up to you. Uh, latest. Hi, my name is Renoa. I'm not a student at Garden, but I'll be staying here for a while. I really like it here. Um, there's something I wanted to say. When you make friends, it'd be nice to be able to finish growing up together without having to think we'll be separated. And if we do grow up apart, I want to be able to meet up and talk with a smile. Hmm? What am I trying to say? Anyway, I don't think I've ever been in a setting with so many people about my age. It's kind of like camp. It's fun. I'm really glad I'm here. Camp? Hey, maybe it is kind of like a camp. Die. It's certainly good this page first. What is this? It was fate. I can't quite explain this page is dedicated. It was fate. I can't quite explain. This page is dedicated to Laguna. No, actually, I call him Sir Laguna. He is such a hunk. At least that's what I think. It seems Sir Laguna was writing in articles in the Timber Maniacs while traveling. Oh, they're his? I'll be posting some of Sir Laguna's articles here. Well, on the seat? Yeah, okay. You understand this picture? So Laguna even wrote Ashtar's secret. But actually, I know what it is. This is where Sir Laguna went scouting. It was okay for this to be published? <laughs> was it okay for this to be published? I guess he really needed the money. According to Sir Laguna, he ended up here when he got lost on the Ashtar continent. I hope Sir Laguna was alright, but what a breathtaking scenery. I want to go too. I want to go, I want to go, I want to go. Y'all know this place? Yes, it's the B hotel in Balaam. So Sir Laguna went to Balaam too. Looks like Sir Laguna likes hotels. The, art the article says he really wanted to stay at the hotel, but he ran out of money. He wasn't able to try the famous Balaam fish. This is amazing. Sir Laguna's with the Shumi tribe. The article says he lost... <laughs> the article says he got lost and injured, but thankfully ended up here. Seems like Laguna gets lost a lot. But he always repays an act of kindness. By the way, the master here is a Shumi. I heard all about it from Squall. Shumi tribe, I want to meet them. She did. This is something extra. This is the entrance to the central ruins. You see in the picture? There's a statue of a sorceress and knight. It's kind of nice, although there are tons of monsters. Wow, Sir Laguna's in a movie. Plus it looks like it was shot near Trabia. He could have been famous. Oh, but I bet you he can't act. He speaks way too highly of himself in the article. I just find it strange that I don't see Ward in the picture. He was right there. Well, looky here. He writes proudly of it in the article. A pub somewhere, plus the owner, no name or location is written down. But actually, I know where it is. I won't say, though, out of respect for Sir Laguna. But if it's that important, he shouldn't have published it in a magazine. But I guess it's something special. To Laguna, finally in FH. This is where he finally made the Ashtar. It was literally everywhere. So it's true that you got the... You know, so it's true that you get there from FH. By, the, by that time, there were no more trains. Oh, that's useful. Now we know how to get the Ashtar. So Sir Laguna walked it. I don't know what the trains were like here. It said this is Laguna in high spirits. After finding out, he had to walk there. Let me know when you find Timber Maniacs. Huh. My diary. Diary 1. I'm not a bit old. Okay. No, quite old first. Quite old. Okay. <laughs> Guess where I'm going next? Previous diary 2. Quite old. Time for the concert. Hee <laughs> hee! The garden festival seems to be out, but the, end, the chances of a concert are pretty high. All thanks to everyone at FH. I'm really looking forward to it. Well, actually, I'm head over heels about it. Day Squall is appointed leader. Squall is appointed as the leader of Garden. Hey, I didn't know he was already famous within this garden. Oh, I get it. That's why. Yeah, Squall can do it, so we should all support him. What? 
People think Squall seems a bit stoic, a bit scary at times, but I don't think that's true at all. He's always thinking to himself, just, but just doesn't look like to say it. From what I see, I think he hates explaining stuff. Guess he's just not used to it. Plus, I don't think he likes to meddle in other people's business. Hey, this isn't a corner dedicated to anal analyzing Squall. We all have to back him up. Garden Festival not to be. Booyaka! The Garden Festival stage has to start over. All over. Hey! When I come back from my shaky first mission, what do I find? Garden and Chaos. Is this going backwards? Garden and Chaos. First of all, let me tell you about my first mission, among other events. Oh yeah, Booyaka! Why is she saying Booyaka? I'm doing fine. Our first mission was in Timber. I can't tell you details about it, but in one word, it was a failure. I keep telling myself the enemy was stronger than us. Grr. We should have won. Well, an accident happened during our mission. The sorceress appeared. Yes, THE sorceress! Her name's Adia. Anyway, Cypher appeared out of nowhere. Then Adia took him off to who knows where. We tried to make it back to the garden, but the trains were down. So we ended up going to Godbody Garden. That garden is quite different from ours. It kind of, re it kind of reminded me of the army or something. That garden too. I received a new order at the Gabadia Garden. I don't think I can write about that here. Missing the outcome. Well, we failed again. The enemy's way too strong. Booyaka! Our target was Sorceress Adia. Oops, I wrote it. Oh my god, you can't unwrite it. Hmm, the most recent and infamous sorceress is Adele, right? She was saying them all to death, didn't she? The sorceress behind the Sorceress War. Back when we were kids? We learned in history class that Sorceress Adele disappeared, and the war just kind of ended, right? A sorceress inherits the power from another sorceress, so I think Adia is the one that received Adele's power. Except she didn't. Just when Sorceress Adia and the President of Galbadia joined forces, she wiped out the President. Which means Sorceress Adia is now controlling Galbadia. This is exactly what the Sorceress wore with Eshtar. Nah, this is exactly like the Sorceress wore with Eshtar. Time to bring out the seeds. Mm. Time to bring out the seeds! Back in Garden 3. Well, we failed our mission, and we hadn't failed to retreat. As a result, we ended up in a prison in the desert of Gabadia. Our leader was tortured, and we were locked up, but we managed to escape. When you're locked up, the only thing you can think about is escaping, right? Hope we did the right thing, or was it against orders? Oh, well. After we escaped, I heard some terrible news. Adia was going to get rid of all seeds by launching missiles at Garden. It's quite obvious that Adia despises seed and wants to get rid of Garden, which trains the seeds. Anyway, after I heard about the missiles, I just couldn't stand still. So I asked our leader, Squall, who did a great job, by the way, to divide up the party so that one team could infiltrate the missile base. This is all before the other entries. Back at Garden 4. The two teams were the messenger team and the missile base team. I was on the missile team and was messing around with the computer to save Garden. I heard it was a close call. But as long as we're all safe, right? Anyway, after messing up the computer, we tried to escape, but uh-oh! We couldn't get out of the base! Never in my whole life did I ever think so seriously about I was going to die. But we were very lucky. We were able to get inside the robot we were fighting. Its armor was what actually saved us from the explosion in the end. That's the only time I was thankful for Galbadia's weaponry. That Garden 5? So anyway... We were inside that robot and made our way over here. Well, not exactly. We were inside, but we had no idea how to control it. To make matters worse, we were picked up by the Galbadi arm and brought over to FH. We were pressing all these buttons trying to get out. But when we realized we were fighting with Squall and the others, I'm sorry we weren't attacking you. Just trying to get out. It's true, really. In any case, Balam Garden is safe. It is, right? And so are we. I guarantee it. I'm just worried about Trabia Garden. Hope everyone's alright. My first mission. Booyaka! No one's using it! Oh my god. I've been assigned my first mission. I'm not sure where where to be sent. Even if I knew, I wouldn't tell you. Once the mission's done, we're free to talk all we want. So just wait, okay? Hope someone's reading this. But wish me luck. I'll be back soon. Worry number one. Side effects of GF. I've been setting up on the GF because I know I'll be using more of it now that I'm a seed. Am I going to lose my memories? Worry two. My other party members, I hope they're nice people. Worry three. The Garden Festival will be on hold. Come on, we're still looking for members. Oh my god, there's still more! Passing the seed exam. I passed the seed exam! Woohoo! Just wanted to let you know, the field exam just 
took place in Dolet. I was a member of Squad A, the intelligence team. I thought to myself this would be easy, but then I was asked to deliver a message. Now that was a nightmare. Oh, well, that's part of my duties anyway. Squad B, which was supposed to secure the Central Square, was nowhere to be found. So I ran and ran. I had to deliver this message because I didn't want points deducted. Selfie is the best character. Well, I ended up finding Squad B, but somewhere completely different, and the squad lead was going berserk. What was going through his head? But anyway, I remained calm and delivered the message. I think that is what got me the points. Anyway, I'll be re I'm really excited to be a seed. Oh yeah, that squad leader actually congratulated us. He's like a nice guy. He's famous at this academy, right? Maybe he joins the garden festival committee. He could be the do the recruiting. Well, good luck with the next field exam, Cypher. No! The first day. Oh, God. Oh, now we learn why. Booyaka! It's a lingo I want to spread. She's never said this out of this thing. Anyway, I've started my own diary. I can't believe I'm doing this. Selfie's public diary. That's a good title, right? I've never kept a diary before. wonder how long it'll last. Well, I hope you find it interesting. Enjoy. I'm from Trabia. It's a really nice place. If you ever get the chance, you should visit something. Not anymore. I'm here because I want to be a seed. Yeah, you can take the written test in Travia, but the field exam is here. And plus, once you become a seed, you'll be stationed here in Valam. That's why I decided to transfer here. I do have a strong attachment for Travia, but before I knew it, I was writing my application for a transfer. And what do you know? My field exam is today. Ah! But I'm happy to go out and do my best. Wish me luck. Why is it all in reverse? Is there more? A day of pondering. I thought the battles were over, but it seems like they'll continue. I wrote before how Cersei's idea of Matron was very special to me. Oh crap, that was the other entry I was supposed to write, read. She was a good sorceress after all. She was possessed by a different sorceress, but she's still in danger. Even if she is being used, it'll be tough fighting with Matron. It was the future sorceress of Ultimissia who was controlling Matron. Her objective is time compression. I wonder what that is. What happens when time is compressed? I'm more afraid of having to fight the Matron than worrying about ti this time compression thing. Also, what happened to Rhinoa? I know Squall is suffering. Isn't there anything we can do? He could be his girlfriend. Did we read this one? The bit old one? Oh yeah, we didn't read this one. Oh god. We did it, everyone. I know I said there'd be no more entries, but I just had to write one more thing. Excellent job, everyone. I love you all. Woohoo! Why is everything in reverse? Today I visited Trabia. I went to visit Trabia. It was a complete shambles. It was in complete shambles. Everyone who survived seems well. Yeah, they were in high spirits. Even if you are pretending to be cheerful, it eventually rubs off on you. And also the side effects of GF, the stuff about losing memory, well, sure enough, it happened to me. I just wasn't aware of it. When all of us were talking, we started to remember a lot of stuff. Even stuff we didn't want to remember. It made me really think that day. Sorcerer D was someone very special to me. But still, I'll fight because I'm a seed. If I write anymore, I think a weak side of me will begin to show. I'm going to stop here. There won't be any more entries in this diary. Thanks so much to all, to all those who took the time to read this. Zero Red. Goodbye, Raijin Fujin. Goodbye, Disciplinary Committee. I hope we can meet again on better terms, I think. I wish I could have said bye. Being blue. I've been feeling blue lately whenever I think about Trabia. Hmm. I want to go. I don't want to go. Concert was fun. We all the concert. Woohoo! She she's not saying you block anymore. Actually, we were the ones performing, so we were really into it. But I wonder how it sounded. What did everyone think, I wonder? I'll forget it. Everyone else should start playing, too. A lot more fun performing. I haven't given up on the Garden Festival, though. So we read everything, I guess? Okay. Oh, I can't pull out? Oh, son of a- no! Uh, there was no pull out button. Alright. Oh, Booyaka, Booyaka! That's Booyaka. Okay, yeah, okay. What's Booyaka from? Booyaka's from something. Good luck, Squall. It'll be a walk in the park for you. I don't expect fancy speeches from you. Just lay the way for us. We're counting on you. That's it. All right. Yeah, pull out. No, not one more time. Uh. Booyaka is actually a thing I used to say when I was younger. How did I forget that? 
I was just saying it wrong. Yeah. Boyaka, boyaka. Yeah, okay, yeah. Now I know. Now, now I get it. Okay. Apparently, the Japanese caught on to that. Or it's not in the Japanese version, only in the American version. Cause, or English version, because why not? But alright, so I'm just heading to the cockpit to say, but um. Wait, where can I sit? Oh, I gotta save at the dorm, huh? Okay, so that right there is the game for now. Next time, we will be going to FH to get the Ashtar. So that right there is the game. I had fun, hope you've been watching. That's what it's all about, isn't having fun. Thanks for coming by, and Booyaka! Booyaka, Booyaka, and Booyaka! <laughs>